Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to have a demonstration demonstration about uh, uh, accessories of L270 uh, light head, and uh, it might be confusing for customers like you when you get our samples or goods, and uh, you you might ask how to use all these a bunch of accessories. But uh, no worries, I'm going to introduce each one of the accessories for you for. The easy understanding, and uh, uh, here you can see uh, in the very front uh, four pieces of T joints, and the last one you can see is uh, comes with a protection cover, and and uh, here we have a one piece of single end uh, extortion cord, okay, one piece here, and uh, here we have three pieces uh, extension cord, but this one comes with double ends. See, so in total we have eight pieces of accessories for a group of four pieces L270 panorama light head. Uh, everyone, uh, next I'm going to introduce you uh, about uh, how we uh, connect all these uh, accessories with light head. So when you take uh, our uh, box and uh, uh, take out all these uh, uh, light heads and accessories. Uh, what's the first step you are going to do uh, to assemble it into actual use? So, uh, right first, uh, we need to take out uh, uh, three pieces of uh, accessories first. Uh, you can see in front of me, we have one piece of single end extension cord. Okay, and uh, we have one piece of T joint. And uh, uh, a third one is uh, we have a double end extension cord and you can see in one of its end it has already been connected to uh, another piece of T-joint okay so here we go with another piece of the uh, uh, product and uh, first you need to take our amazing product L270 by the name of Panorama and uh, we, I'm going to put it here and first uh, we, uh, you, you have this T-joint and you have this uh, uh, single extension cord uh, so we are going to connect these two two, two steps okay. first uh, you need uh, plugging and uh, tightening it so uh, no more strip or dust coming in to do the damage to the product okay. and uh, we, and now we connect the uh, second end of the T-joint to the uh, double end extension cord. Uh, same method. Uh, first, uh, you need a uh, plugging and uh, tightening it. Okay, very easy. And the last one, we need to uh, connect uh, the last end of the T-joint uh, with the product. Uh, it's the same as. Uh, Plugging and tightening it. Okay. Really need to pay attention to the tightening here because some of the moisture might come in. Okay. Now uh, it's finished. Uh, the very first piece of uh, L270 in a group of four pieces, and uh, you can uh, connect all the three by the same method from this end on. So you can see in front of me, we have uh, uh, made, uh, made the connection complete. And uh, first, and uh, now we are going to test if all these connections we did in our last procedure are okay. So I'm going to prove it by connecting with the power. Okay, now it flashes. And you can see it's uh, very easy, the connection part is very easy. Now you have made, we have uh, light up the uh, light head. So friends, uh, when you complete uh, the installation on top of your, or your car roof uh, uh, about our uh, product uh, L270 light head, and uh, I'm going to introduce how we uh, a few features about this uh, product and. Uh, here we have on my right side we have uh, a demo board to simulate uh, uh, that uh, on a top of car roof we have like uh, two pieces uh, light head on the front and the other two pieces on the rear. So we are, I'm going to turn it on the light head. Now you can see the flashes. 
very strong light. Uh, it's okay uh, to use uh, its own uh, broad daylight, but uh, the light output uh, might be a little disturbing when when you drive your car on a on let's say on in a uni or night night occasion. And uh, so uh, to to sort sort about it, uh, uh, we have a convenient option, and that is a uh, 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 fifty percent light up output, and uh, we have one wire to control that. And I'm going to limit it to half of its light output. So uh, I don't know you, if you can see clearly, but uh, now it, the light output has uh, reduced to half its uh, amount. And uh, here we can also go into select our preference the flash patterns. I'm going to show you a few flash patterns. So this is a quick one. Another one. So when you so by this you can choose your preference flash patterns. 